I want to get to the piece that everyone is up in arms about on the internet. It is Stompies. Um, so again, removed airborne effectiveness of penalties. You only gain increased speed, slide distance, and improved jumping while your dodge energy is full. So the again if you want to read the dev commentary you can but the general premise is that stompies originally got nerfed because of the og og changes to airborne effectiveness people hated it stompies it didn't go away but like it went down to a very low usage number obviously young on young i'm hot young um, car spine whatever that i don't know why i struggle with that word but that uh exotic now became the more again that's why we've been in this trip my meta it's because when stompies was nerfed uh, again frosties did tick up a little bit uh, again i don't have the graph on me it did tick up a little bit in usage after the nerf became active but um what we see more is this trip mine meta and so now what's happening is like you won't have the airborne effect now. so we're gonna see again as much as people are complaining about being a nerf with the removal of the airborne effectiveness penalties more people are going to use stompies that's that's just it, it is what it is and i think that's a lot of part a part of what folks are missing and all the like oh let's just be mad on the internet stuff that's going on right now but the fact is that um you only get the buff that you used to get with stompies when you have your dodge fully charged are there ways to keep your dodge charged um, and keep that uptime high yes there are going to be people who know how to build it again ultimately rebalance and reimagine all right that's like what we have to continue to come back to is bungie wants us to build craft and so build crafting honestly this is not a nerf uh, um i'm just gonna be flat out with you it's not a nerf or it's not as bad of a nerf as folks want to make it seem because honestly there's so many ways that you can ensure that your dodge energy is full both in terms of your armor build crafting as well as what you're actually doing with your kit uh um again void kit art kit strand whatever there's so many different ways that you can ensure that you you have high up time on your dodge and so um yes it's a nerf because now you just can't slide and do everything everywhere all the time whether your dodge is charged or not uh, you have to think more intentionally right uh and I, I think that's not a bad thing uh as someone who I can't say that I mastered Stompies, but once I start playing with Stompies, I understood the hype. I understood why it's so valuable. Uh, and again, that's what we try and do here is just like, you know, I really don't try and like say things that are like too one side of the spectrum or not. I really try and like see what the temperature of the, the community is, test things out for myself and form my opinion. And so once the original Stompies nerf happened, actually tried out stompies for a while and i saw the like appeal of it right and now like i actively keep you know stompies you know infused to the highest level things like that and i still play with it from time to time again not as much as my other builds but i do from time to time and so um knowing that knowing it's so easy to build into your dodge uh, i i i'm i'm actually again a little bit ashamed <laughs> a little bit frustrated um by how people continue to approach this topic of nerves and buffs because one nine times out of ten people are just not actually playing with the, the update in game you're not playing with the nerf or buff in game yet we, we don't see this until next season which is still like a month away right <laughs> so like one you know there's that and then two it's also the piece that like there's so much that you can do build crafting wise that even just thinking about it right now as a warlock main not a hunter main i can think of at least three or so different combinations of how you could like have a kit like your void kit arc kit strand kick whatever and that plus a really solid armor build out and you really don't have to worry about that so you can always have your little Im improved jumping slide distance etc or hear me out guess what just don't use your dodge you're like oh that's the hunter identity so and so forth again rebalance reimagine those are the key terms that bungie is using here and so this is not like a pro bungie stance this is just it is what it is right so again you have to take bungie at their word and what they're saying is they're trying to rebalance things and so now that you have to have a very clear 
cost benefit like analysis you actually have to like figure out what the risk reward usage is for that because it's still going to be potent it's going to be powerful but it's risk and reward on top of the fact that if folks don't already know and i don't know how this is still escaping a lot of folks analysis you still have to build craft bungie is pushing us to build craft so uh again uh this is just it's just not as big of a nerf as folks are saying uh, that's really going to be my only two cents on the topic. I'm really not going to. I thought about doing a Twitter rant, but it was just like, you know, this is this is where I'm at with it. It's just like one chill, chill out, y'all. OK, we have we're not even in season 21 and y'all like up in arms about something we haven't played with in game. Uh, and two, knowing that Stompies is still going to be potent, you just have to be using it intentionally. You know again like come on let's let's be fair to the system let's give things a chance before you're just like this is the worst nerf ever bungie is terrible how about you actually play with it <laughs> how about you actually play with it in game next season and then let's have a conversation but again uh with this change and with the other changes that are, are coming in the pipeline season 21 i really do hope that folks give them a chance uh because it's oftentimes like seven times out of ten not every time, but you know, six and a half, seven times out of 10, these nerfs and buffs are never as bad as we make them out to seem. Or, and again, I'm saying the collective we, although I'm not out here complaining about snoppies, but the collective we, the collective community, tends to make things out worse than what they actually are in game. So again, get out there um, next season, play with these changes, and then, you know, let's return to the conversation.